This is Coach Mack. Welcome to Beneath the Surface, powered by Microsoft. Today, we're going to look at some various run schemes of the Denver Broncos for Monday night's game against the Tennessee Titans. What we want to look at today is the run game because the, the passing game, John Elway has added a lot of weapons for young quarterback Drew Locke. But let's take a look at the run game and some of the schemes that the Titans will face on Monday night football. First play we're going to see from the Texans here. This is 12 personnel. You can see the heavy tight ends to the defensive right. Tight end is going to come across in motion and now then come back when the ball is snapped behind the line of scrimmage. They've added a ghost reverse to this play and then Lindsey is able to read across the line of scrimmage with his cut. He can either keep it front side or he can cut back where the tight end has come across and made what we call a crunch block on the end man on the line of scrimmage. The next play we're looking at is 12 personnel, but now the second tight end is in the backfield as a fullback. Still the same type of block, but now it comes off of a read action type of look with Freeman getting the ball, but the quarterback still having the read option type of look when you see him place the ball in his stomach and then he's reading the second level defense, whether to hand it off or to pull it and throw it. This next play is again 12 personnel. You can see it's heavy to the defense's left side. The tight ends are over here on this side. The back is offset. This now is what we call a draw G. The draw G starts with the guard or the backside guard pulling the left guard from the offensive viewpoint, pull, and now this is a pin and pull play. They're pinning everybody down on the side of the line of scrimmage and then they're pulling the backside guard. Again, this is 12 personnel, 83 is the second tight end. He is in the backfield now. Same type of crunch look, but now it's coming from the, the back is in a dot look. Watch number 83 come across, block the element on the end of the line of scrimmage. And again, Lindsey is now gonna read and see which hole opens up and which linebackers eye discipline they have fooled. The last play is 11 personnel. Now they're gonna bring a wide out in and insert between the tackle and the tight end to create another gap. This is another nice innovation that Denver has done with their run game. This creates a dilemma for the second and third level defenders to, for their gap responsibilities. This insert between the tackle and the tight end is another element to this run game that the Tennessee Titans are going to have to be well aware of and be very disciplined to play.